Welcome back to www.espressoitalia.com.au Our toll free number is 1300 660 976 Right now I'm going to explain to you how to connect your cooler to the cappuccino torre of the Seiko Royal Cappuccino The cooler, as you saw before, we plugged it in and we changed the um, temperature to Celsius and we press the arrow down to 6 degrees which is the minimum cooling temperature of the cooler. Now it, is, it has cooled down to 9 degrees now. What you need to bear in mind with these Espresso Italia 2 cool coolers is the fan is in the back of the uh, unit so under no circumstances should the cooler be up against a wall because the fan needs to circulate to cool. So always leave a minimum of say 200 to 250 millimetres if it's up near a wall to give it ventilation so it can cool effectively. Otherwise it will not cool effectively. Now the machine, uh, the cooler, the two cool cooler does come pre-drilled and it does have a, a silicon hose which you need to um, connect to the cappuccino torre. This is the cappuccino torre. Remember the swivel base on the machine. Be careful when you swivel it because if your water is full, it may move. So, to take the cappuccino torre off, it's very simple. Just hold the machine and just pull the cappuccino torre off the machine. And there you have the cappuccino torre. This valve here where the cappuccino torre goes into, it does move. So that's normal. Don't think that there's, a, any, there's no dramas there. That's normal function. And then what you need to do is, I'll show you how to clean this effectively as well. The top, oh, excuse me, the top piece is, uh, doesn't serve any purpose really, it's just aesthetic. Take that off. The steam pin, which goes in the top of the cappuccino torre, if you lift this steam pin up, you will increase the uh, uh, froth, and if you push it down, you will get less froth. There is a lid which you can just pop off with your thumb, like that. There is a O-ring there, and that will seal. There is a groove as well there with, where the hook, where the hose clips into. Um, when you put it back on, make sure that it matches up with the steam pin, and then pop it on. It only goes on one way. That's the only way it goes on. And then you have your elbow here, which you can just jiggle that off, and keep that. Take the hose off, and just put that over here, and then connect the hose from the Too Cool Espresso Italia cooler. Just push that on all the way, and then hook your elbow back on to the bottom of the steam pin, and just push it up nice and tight, like that, and then put your lid back on, that should clip on, and then connect it back up to the Seiko Royal Cappuccino. Push it in like so and it should go all the way in like that and it's in position. If it's not pushed all the way in it will not work. Bear that in mind. So it should be all the way in like that. It should be sitting about 10 mil. The elbow should be about 10 millimeters away uh, from the edge of the casing of the machine of the Seiko Royal Cappuccino. So the cooler is now connected to the Seiko Royal Cappuccino and you're watching www.espressoitalia.com.au and our toll free number whenever you like 24 hours a day is 1300 660 976